Sure. I wanted to ask on this question of, uh, of Tony Blair and his UN role in the Middle East process. Mm -hmm. It's been reported over the weekend that, that he uh, has a contract with Petro Saudi for 41,000 pounds a month to lobby for their interest. And so it's been raised in the press in the UK, but I thought to ask the UN, is this viewed in any way as, as a potential conflict of interest given his role in the Middle East peace process? And who reviews that here at the UN? Uh, well, this, uh, as you know, he is not a UN employee. Uh, he is uh, an envoy of the quartet rather than of sure. the United Nations. Uh, ultimately, uh, your questions would have to go to Tony Blair Associates. But I mean, the thing is that he can't, uh, it seems strange to ask him if he thinks that receiving 41,000 pounds a month is a conflict. When is the Secretary General, as a member of the quartet, is he comfortable with those payments? And how does he explain, what does he say to those who say, given Saudi Arabia has, has a particular, you know, uh, view of that conflict, that taking this amount of money may be, present a conflict? I think any questions about the envoy for the quartet would have to be resolved among the members of the quartet itself. I, I wouldn't speak individually for the Secretary General on that.